Oh, hello. Oh, cool. Thank you. Hey, the amazing Rando. Watch Rando the Great construct sets with his very mind. What's up, rascals? Welcome to Phasmophobia. Now, over the weekend, me and my friends were talking about uh, getting together and playing this game, and uh, I figured, why the heck not check it out solo run for now, just, just to see what it's like. And, uh, yes, I know it could also be done in VR, but, uh, I don't yet have a VR. Oh, okay. Just jump right to that. Fine, that's, that's cool. So, what are we doing here? Um, do I have equipment? Do I, should I grab equipment? I guess I should see about grabbing some equipment. Or, is this literally just... All right. Uh, training! I, I'm learning... Listen out for distant sounds. Okay. How do you listen out? Anyway, this... So far... This is more than I expected. I, I mean... Be able to use voice recognition? I'm actually going to be communicating with ghosts, not just being a snarky son of a son. You've been at 90% for like three minutes straight, and it's getting a little bit annoying. You're obviously not loading that much if you've been at 90% for this long without anything else to do. Why don't you reticulate some splines or something like the Sims do? I, why the hell do I have to sit here staring at you doing nothing? I want to play a game, that's why I clicked play a game. And you're just frustrating me to no end. So while we're waiting for it to load, which may take the entirety of this episode, um, how have you been doing? I've been all right, except for the fact that uh, been like away from hell. Practically been away from my computer, except for binge watching random reaction channels. Uh, I don't know why. You know, there's so many other things I could be doing besides standing here waiting for this damn thing to finish loading. Is it going to actually load the game? Because it's, it's been like this for quite a while. And... You know what? I'm, I'm kind of getting sick of it. Oh? Are we actually in it? Oh my! We're actually in it, and... Why can't I... Oh, okay. Nice. Right. Okay. Oh. Did they? Uh, Alright, strange glowing lights. And a white lady. Of course. Ooh, that's creepy. Alright, so this is basically Bigfoot with ghosts. Nice. We found a non-violent ghost that you can use to train for ghost hunting skills. We've already located the ghost in the foyer. Head inside and read the slideshow we have set up for you on the TV. That TV? No. That TV. No, I gotta go inside and do this stuff. Okay, so do I get ghost equipment? Ah! What about... Ah, there we go. Grabs. Grabs. And grab. What about grab? Grab? Can I not grab? Or am I limited to how much I can grab? I guess I'm limited to how much I can grab. Can I check my inventory? Oh. 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 Neat. Okay, so this is going to help me detect 
EVPs and such. Nice. Uh, how do I get out of here? Oh. That sounded kind of sinister. Oh, and it's a dark and spooky rainy night. All right. Nothing detected. Of course not. What's a foyer anyway? Foyer, whatever. I'm not... Can I... Ah. The buttons are a little bit weird here. Jill? Jill? Should I close the door? Okay, there we go. What did that say? Welcome to the Ghost Hunter's Training Guide. This guide will show you how to become a professional ghost hunter. Use the TV remote to go to the next slide. Alright. Right. Okay. So do I have to run and crouch? I'm just hunting ghosties. Right? Push to talk is V. I might accidentally flip, flick that. T is the flashlight. On an investigation, you will have around five minutes before the ghost will anger and drop your sanity faster. Use this time to set up equipment and find the ghost. For today, though, you don't have to worry about that. Oh, okay. Set up a video camera inside the ghost's room, then head back to the truck and watch the CCTV monitor for a ghost orb. If you spot one, write it on the last page of your journal. If not, go to the next screen. Grab the ghost writing book and place it inside the ghost's room. If the ghost writes on the page, then write on it on the last page of your... Okay. Grab the spirit box in the truck. I, that's what I've got now. Enter the ghost room with the lights out and ask the ghost questions with your voice. Oh. Neat. So where's the foyer? I should have grabbed a flashlight. Hello. Would you mind speaking with me? Could you repeat that? Oh, I'm already lost. I'm confused. I'm gonna go back to the truck and get me a flashlight. Maybe. What? Alright. I don't feel like I did anything. Okay, this time... I'm a. There we go. I've also written some notes on the whiteboard if you need them. All right, this time I can actually see where I'm heading. And grab you and grab you. I I like the I like the EMF detector so. That's what I'm gonna grab. Alright. So. Oh. I can place this cam. It's a DSLR. Okay. Nice. Alright. Let's do this. Hello? Is there someone here with me? 
Hmm, okay. All right, so let's just go ahead and leave this room. It's not where we need to be. In fact, I'm kind of invading somebody's privacy. The ghost is probably going to get a little bit upset with me if I just keep playing like this. Oh, hello! Snazzy mustache. Master bedroom. Oh! Oh! Oh, why did I think that... Now, now I need to find the master bedroom and put it in there. Oh, I'm so silly. Alright, so, I need to pick up the camera, find the master bedroom, and, uh... And, uh, then... You know... Do some ghost investigating stuff. Yeah, that's... That's it. Uh... Uh, my money's on this room being the master bedroom. Nope. I was clearly wrong. Ah. Why is the light on? Eh, that works. Uh-oh, did I drop my flashlight? <laughs> Great. I'm... I'm now blind and stuck. Uh, okay. Yeah, that's definitely not where I wanted to go. Alright, sorry, Mr. Ghosty Man. I'm... I'll be out of here as soon as I pick up my... My flashlight that I didn't mean to drop. Alright, so... <laughs> Alright, um... Go ahead and close that, and, uh, yeah. Head back to the truck. With any luck, I'll be catching evidence. Yeah, with my upside down camera. Uh, all right. So far, nothing. Maybe he got fed up with me because I took too long to get out of his room. Or her room. I don't know exactly what gender this ghost is. They wouldn't speak to me. I'm probably a terrible ghost hunter anyway. <laughs> My sanity is at 71%. And dropping. Okay, it's fluctuating. Not necessarily dropping. Cute. Total activity. Ooh. Did I miss something? Oh. Yes. No. Okay. No orbs. Hmm. Maybe I should chill out in there or something? Hmm. I don't know. Let's go ahead and try it one more time. Go on in there and see what we can see. Why is the light on again? I know I turned it off. Oh, wait.
Oh, get back to the truck. Is that part of the activity? Because I know I turned it off. Oh, look at that. The total activity. It spiked. Ooh. Oh. Knock that den into the journal, maybe. Evidence one. Uh, ghost orb, ghost writing, freezing temperatures. No. Uh, no evidence there. Uh-huh. Head back in there and... And see if we can't see something. Or... Or invoke something. Well, I don't want to invoke something. Invoke and provoke are kind of similar. Alright. Hello? Do you mind if I just sit in here? Hello? Is there someone in here with me? Go ahead and there. Hello. Oh. Interesting. Um, so I know I didn't do that, but... Um... Are you on? Okay. So, but, nope, that's not what I want to do. Why can't I set it down? Instead of just... Fine, I'll set you right there. Eh, close enough. Alright, so I'm going to get out of your space now. If you want to do anything extra, uh, I guess be my guest. Okay. The light just went on, like, on its own, quote unquote. So that was some kind of paranormal activity evidence. Because I was nowhere near the light switch. I don't think. 
The activity is kind of getting there. And my sanity is kind of low now. That's not good. Is there any way to like... Is there any kind of... The spirit box didn't go off. Fingerprints didn't... Nope. Ah. Uh, I don't have it. Wait, what was that? Anything? Well, food. This is what those on those ghost hunting shows would call inconclusive. <laughs> 